Okay, um, I got home today and look what came. A box from Newegg. So let's open her up because this will be the other hard drive that I ordered, which is a 640 gigabyte hard drive. Uh, it's not a deep uh, well inside the laptop for a hard drive, so you have to use a thinner hard drive. Uh, so a 750 was just out. But hey, oh well. So let's dig for it. Dig for it. Uh -huh. Oh my god, my cat's gonna go ape shit once he sees all these peanuts. Okay, okay. Uh, bubble wrap. You know what we need? Knife. Big knife. Nobody keeps me away from my Christmas presents. No one. Oh. Okay. Big knife. Delicate parts. What a great combination. Anybody buy one bubble wrap? I'll give it to you. Ah, too bad you're halfway around the world. Uh, uh. Okay, anyway, Western Digital. Look at that. Always Western Digital. Yeah. Alright, well, carefully open this one up. Look at that. Brand new. Not used, not formatted. Serial ATA, 640 gigabytes. And that looks sexy. All right, we're gonna put this just right on the side right here. And we're gonna open up the laptop. Open up the laptop. Okay, this will give you a good view of the NVIDIA uh, GPU, all the heat piping and stuff inside the ASUS uh, notebook for gaming. G60, is it G60? That's it. Okay. <laughs> You saw in the previous videos that I already did a mod for the cooling, which is awesome. Uh, I love that mod. I don't care if I killed my warranty doing it, I love it. I love it to pieces. Now, of course, I'll have to format this hard drive once in Windows using Windows um, or the Drive Manager. Oh, fun RCP services. <laughs> Keyboard's true, just a little bit thinner than the rest of them. I'll find that true later. <laughs> now the bad thing is, even though this is a nice laptop, and it can support another hard drive, it doesn't come with the a uh, hard drive case, and you'll see exactly what I mean uh, once I crack this bad boy open. <laughs> now this has a huge bottom panel to take off, uh, and it basically is one giant panel for everything. Make sure all the screws are out. Oh, that one out. Yep. All right, looks good. Let's see if it is. Yep, here we go. Right here, beautiful laptop, dual heat sinking. Uh, you have your south gate. Uh, no, your north gate, your CPU. Uh, south gate's underneath here. Uh, and you have your NVIDIA GeForce. The GTX 260. So it's a beautiful laptop, four gigs of RAM. Isn't that just fucking amazing? Look at that, it's beautiful. Anyway, before I give myself a woody looking at this laptop, just joking there. Uh, I'm going to pop in the new hard drive. Very simple installation. You'll see there's another drive section here. The original hard drive here. Uh, I said there's no bracket uh, to mount it in, but that's okay. Uh, it works just the same. And slide it in, just like that. Uh, now, of course, you want to keep something right here so it won't go flying out if you drop it or whatnot. I don't know why you drop a laptop anyway, but, you know, shit happens. So let's do that. Uh, I just got some pink styrofoam from a previous new egg supporter. Just gonna cut up a section. And I'll hopefully just go in there. <laughs> Operation. 
Alright, yes, don't. This doesn't look professional, but hey, I don't care. It works, does the job. Okay, very simple installation. Look at that, boom. Uh, now this laptop has about a terabyte of hard drive space, which will be nice. We're gonna remount the cover back on, just as so. So, a very simple installation, as you see. No, nothing complicated about it. Now with that really thin hard drive screw, or uh, a hard drive screw, but uh, yeah, this is the one for the keyboard. The keyboard one's just a little bit thinner. I recommend putting that one in first if you're doing that. Oh, where the hell's my screwdriver? Found it. Oh, son of a bitch! I would not grab the hard drive one. Uh, keyboard one. God damn it, I keep saying hard right now. Come out. Out of the hole. Thank you. Uh, that's what she said. I'm gonna find everything sexually perverse in my videos and make one giant long video about it. Just everything. Wouldn't that be funny? Every dirty thing I say in a YouTube video. All rolled out in one YouTube video. That thing would have more censorship beeps in it than the Bible on public radio. Oh my god, that was a low blow. Sorry, Christians. The tall screws uh, on this series are marked by the little screw uh, logos so you don't mix up what screws you're putting in and what screws you're not supposed to be putting in, which is a neat feature because if you, if you use a longer screw than you're supposed to in a hole, uh, well, you end up screwing right through your keyboard and stuff, and that just kind of sucks. Uh, nobody likes a screwy keyboard. I'm sorry this is taking so long. I really uh, I'm screwing as fast as I can here. Uh, yet another dirty thing I can say. Well, anyway. Screw professionalism. If I was if I was doing this as a professional video, I wouldn't have used pink styrofoam to keep my hard drive in place now, would I? No, no, you're right, Pat. Absolutely right, you're a freaking genius. Absolutely freaking genius, look at that. Alright, screw hole that I have to do. Unless there's one already in there. No. Aha, uh -huh, look at that. All right, bitches. Okay. Flip it over. Boot her up. Uh, I'm going to resume Windows. Uh, since this uh, motherboard and stuff can support eSATA, it'll also support hot swapping out hard drives, especially in the SATA 2 position. Uh, I'm going to load up the uh, drive manager in the uh, administration tools and show you what I'm going to set up. I'm going to set up uh, 50 gigabytes from the drive to run encrypted partitioning and then I'm going to set up the rest of the drive just for general media and file storage which will be fun. Yay! Happy New Year! Yes, I'm a kid, but oh well, I'm not a kid. I wish I was a kid. Man, I'm, I wish those days were I miss those days where I could just run and run and run and nobody would look at me goofy for it. Hell, I just wish I could run and run and run. God damn it. I gotta raise the camera here a little bit. Raise the roof. Okay, we just want... Oh my god, it's the Vista boot up noise. And Windows 7. This is going just as I planned now, is it? Alright, now we're in disk management. Uh, you also notice that the hard drive is right there. Uh, a little under 600 gigabytes. No hard drive is that, no hard drive is going to be the full speed. Um, because, or the, not the full speed, god damn it. Full size, simply because it just doesn't work that way, unfortunately. Uh, we're going to do a 50 gigabyte partition right here. So if I, uh, let's go with her. Do I no, five gigabytes. Next, 
50 gigabytes. Uh, assign a drive letter, D. D is good. Well, we're not going to use D. Uh, use D. Um, and then, default, volume, how big? Go. Load. <laughs> and the other part we're going to format later, you'll see right here. Uh, 4.8 gigabytes, which is going to be our encrypted volume. And then we're going to have another space right here that we're going to set up. Uh, so that's it. Uh, that's how to set up a hard drive in a Asus G60 gaming laptop.